Happy Payday Friday. Listen, if this Friday and you ain't getting paid, I don't know what you're doing out there. How y'all doing today? I really, really miss you. I'm glad we got some time to spend together. Listen, this is like my most favorite day of the week. Payday Friday, you know what I mean? Especially if you're a caregiver, if you've been working hard all week, you know what I mean, to help other people, to put other people's needs in front of yours, and you're getting paid today? I'm, I don't know what it is. It's my favorite day. I just wanted to spend it with you. How y'all doing today? I miss you. I miss you. Had the Rona, had to fall back for a minute, but look, I'm back. Who am I? My name is Kion Church. I connect the paychecks to the pockets. Meet the new boss of in-home health care. My camera's kind of crazy, but, uh, you know, y'all gonna be all right. So look, what do I do? I connect the pockets to the paychecks, you know what I mean? I help family, I help challenge family members, I help financially, let's get it all the way right, we're gonna start it over. I help financially challenge family members to become paid caregivers through the Medicaid long-term health care program. So look, if you're a person right now who's watching this and you got some family members who are on that long-term Medicaid and you doing the best you can to take care of them, you need to put that paycheck in your pocket. Mr. Gary, how you doing today, man? How y'all doing today? So look, if you here with me now, hashtag your city, hashtag your state, hashtag live, hashtag rebroadcast. Let the people know that you here with me. Look, this is a big hearted caregiver event and it's Friday. So listen, if you ain't getting paid for what you're doing, you need to call me. Cause look, when this thing come in right here, y'all see that? When that thing come in right there, that means it's a good time. It's a good Friday every time you get paid. You know, if you working for other people and you putting their needs first, you know, you might be kind of sacrificing yourself in your real life because it's hard to make money outside the house. I'm going to help you out. That's what we're going to do, man. Now, listen, this thing ain't for everybody. I got to tell you because, you know, some people get in this unemployment and they like, look, Casey, I don't want to work right now. Listen, I ain't mad at you, but you can't continue to put other people's needs in front of yours. And I don't know how long that unemployment gonna last, but if you can live off of it, man, and they can live off of it, that's good. That's an awesome thing. Now, if you need a little help, you want KC put that money in your pocket, call me, 302-689-3240. Now listen, I'm gonna tell you what we are doing. I hired a company called Puzzle HR. Shout out to my boy, Mike Hines. He has put together a super big plan to get all the most talented. I said, how are you gonna get the most talented, Mike? He said, look, we're gonna put together the most talented caregivers in the Newcastle, Kent County, Sussex area. And he said, I'm gonna shoot them all your way, man. All the people that, you know, honestly wanna work, all the people that honestly care for other people, you know, just as much or maybe even more than themselves. He said, look, I'm gonna get them all to your doorstep. So in the mix of that, man, I've noticed that it's a lot of baby boomers, a lot of, you know, y'all know what the baby boomer industry was, you know, people who came out of like wartime, you know, 50s babies, you know, a lot of people who right now are sort of making a, re a run on retirement, I should say, you know what I mean? How y'all doing? They texting me and everything. Get on the live with us, baby. Look, anytime you see KC on, you need to hit that button so you can get, go live with me all the time. Get all the live notifications. Stay up with me. This pay a Friday. This thing is awesome. We need to share this thing. Let everybody know you can get paid for taking care of your loved ones. So listen, we reaching out to all the baby boomers, all the people who trying to make a run on an early retirement, all the people that's like, look, I don't want to go to Walmart. <laughs> you know what I mean? Walmart is crazy. It's a million people in there. You got to keep your mask on. You know what I mean? They got a lot of things going on. We ain't with that. But we do love people. And what's better than being able to take care of somebody and get paid for that? That's an awesome thing, man. Put money in your pocket and all I did is help people all day? Shh, talk about easy, man. I, hey, listen, if you know somebody, you know what I mean, uh, 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 that, that identifies with, with, with good things like that, that's a good thing, you know? Now, I had a lady call me a couple days ago. She said, look, KC, my mother's qualified. She's in a program and I'd like to start getting paid to take care of her. She said, I already take care of her. You know, that that's that's just what she do. Tootie, how you doing today? She said, but, you know, mom just got accepted to the program. So we trying to put a few dollars in our pocket. I said, well, listen, I got the program for you. This is how we going to do it. Kristen, what's going on with you today? Look, as you coming in, hashtag your city, hashtag your state, let them know that you, you a real big hearted caregiver, man. Me and you, 
we like to sing. We, we put other people's needs in front of our own. So let everybody know you're here with me today. So listen, in my quest to help as many people as I can, I told the lady, I said, look, I would love to hire you to take care of your mother. See, sometimes, sometimes people need a little help because they got to go to work. You know, some people got high demanding jobs and they just can't stop. And they say, KC, what can you do for me? And I said, well, look, I got the best caregivers in the business. You know what I mean? I sent them around there to take care of your mother just like, you know, she was our own mom, you know, because that's what we do. But the big thing to it right now, 2021, is if you're already there, we could put the paycheck in your pocket. What's sweeter than that? What's sweeter than that? I'm going to pay you for doing what you already doing, man. I, I, I love to share the wealth. Look, a guy told me a long time ago, he said, look, KC, ain't no fun unless my friends can get some. And that's like the, the theory that I adopted. You know what I mean? If I can't get none, I don't know what it is. Kristen, how you doing today, baby? Look, give me some Facebook love. Give me some hearts. Give me some, give me some of them thumbs. I really love that wow face. If you see KC on the web, hit that wow face. Share this thing. Let everybody know. Look, I know where you can get that good help at. You know what I mean? KC, he's over there and, and, and they putting it together. Reliable A got a crazy program, man. All we do is help people. That's it. That's it. So I'm trying to get my blessings. I'm going to show you a couple blessings too. Listen, it's Friday. I don't know who you're working for right now. But if they don't get the checks dropped off for FedEx, man, and I don't, I don't know. I don't know. But over here, we do it a little different. If you worked all week, we're going to pay you. You know what I mean? Now, that money is especially good if you got a family, especially if you got a family that you're taking care of and you can share it with them. That's awesome, man. I don't know about you, but when I was a kid, I always tried to do extra things to raise money. You know what I mean? To bring money in around the house. It wasn't necessarily to like fatten my own pockets. You know what I mean? Because my parents always took care of me, but I wanted a little extra. You know what I mean? I used to go, they had a supermarket up the street called Acme. <laughs> True story. I used to go around Acme and I used to push the carts. You know what I mean? I'd catch an old lady coming out the parking lot. And I'd be like, hey, let me help you out with that. So I, I just snatched the cart straight up. I walked the cart straight to her car, put all the groceries in there. I don't even ask for no money. End of the job, she'd probably say, oh, young man, that was nice. Boom, boom, boom. Give me a couple dollars. You know what I mean? It was probably some change, handful of change. You know how them old ladies did it. They used to have that pocketbook, that little purse with the two things on it. And they snap that thing and pull, it, pull the thing back. And they say, here you go, baby. Pull that change out and give it to you. <laughs> Y'all don't know nothing about that, man. Y'all y'all two, two thousand. Look, we got to call y'all back. We on a live right now. You know what I mean? You want to catch me? Go live with me, man. Don't call me while we on a live. We with the people. But look, do what you got to do. Bring that little extra change home, man. Your peoples will appreciate it. They appreciate it. You hanging out with them every day. You giving them all the, all the good love and the attention that they need. Add a check with that. Mm. Let me think about that. Mm, that's strong. Add a check with that. Add a check with that. Look, it's payday Friday, and if you ain't saying yay wherever you at, you on the train on the wrong track. Simple as that, man. Simple as that. So look, if you want to get down with the right crowd, you here now. You know what I mean? Look, tag your cousin. You know he living on his mama's couch. You know, he darn near 50. You know what I'm saying? Now, he does do a good job at taking care of her, but he don't realize that he's eligible for a check. You know, mom struggling. He obviously struggling. He need a little help. Put his name in the comment, man. I will do what I got to do to get his mom into the program. And now everybody can be safe over there. You know what I mean? We're going to do the right thing. So if you here with me, you doing the right thing, man. Shout it out. You know, I got to go because uh, I got to make a couple stops and pop got to go to dialysis. So listen, we love you. I'm glad that you're here with me. You know what I mean? If you looking to uh, reap the rewards for all the work, the good work that you're doing, let me know. You know what I mean? Two, do you agree? That's good. That's good. I always knew you were smart, too. I knew that. I definitely knew that. So, look, call me if you need me. That's all I can say. 302-689-3240. Listen, don't let anybody shame or blame you into thinking that what you're doing is wrong because your parents are your best assets, man, so you got to work hard to take care of them. You know what I mean? Look, I love you. I got to go. All right? I'm out. KC's out. Catch me on the flip side, baby. Talk to you next Friday. Now, we're going to get together before that, though. But uh, got to go. Look, they texted me already. I got to get out of here. I love y'all. Take it easy.